This video is on how to charge a battery using one of these fancy new digital battery chargers. These things are great because they have displays to show you what percentage that the uh, battery is actually charged on this display up here. We've got our two standard uh, positive and negative uh, terminals uh, off of this unit to connect to the battery. So. The only thing you have coming out of this is your AC power plug. So we stick that in there. Now, in the old days, you would have to hold these apart because if they actually hit, you're going to get some sparks out of the, the old type chargers. Well, nowadays, you still don't want these to touch, but these things are great because most of them have uh, units built into them that will keep them from shorting out. So, stick the AC plug in. Unit powers up, comes up with a display. This thing, by the way, I think I only paid, uh, it was just slightly over $50 at uh, one of the department stores. You can get them pretty much anywhere now. Comes on with a display like that. Uh, you take your negative black terminal off of the charger here, connect it to your negative on your battery post. You can see the negative sign right there. Then you look on your battery, see where your positive sign is right there so positive is red you connect your connector there now when we connect that you notice that our display changes when it's off like that we'll just wait a second for that go, to go back to its default uh, state which let's power that up again just so we can see that when this particular unit comes on it'll uh, power up with, I think, yeah, zeros. So anyways, we connect it to the battery. You know you got, you got something correctly happening here because it'll come up with a display. And in this case, we can look along here. There's really only three buttons to hit. Uh, your automotive batteries are going to be a standard type battery, and that's what's lit here. This green LED is above standard. Um, so that's, there's nothing to set here unless you're, you're not doing a vehicle battery or some particular type of battery you'll muck with that button but in this case we're not um, here's our display Do we want to see the, the voltage of the battery or the percentage charge so I like to put it on the percentage charge because realistically that's all you really know, gotta know I mean there's 12.2 volts this is a 12 uh, 12 volt uh, car battery but we want to charge it so we want to know what percent charge it's at so we hit the button it'll go up to your percentage of charge which in this case is obviously 56 percent the middle button on this unit tells us what type of battery a 2 amp small battery I believe that's like a motorcycle battery uh, medium and of course you're going to read the manual for this unit and it'll tell you but in this case there's a, a medium and a large so I hit it once the LED comes on under small 2 amp small and that's basically going to be the rate that this is going to charge at. I hit it again, and then this is kind of a funky little unit because when you hit that, this will go back to default to the voltage. So I'm going to hit this button again, and then go right quick like that, and it'll go to the medium charge, which is basically the, the uh, amount of uh, current that you're going to charge this battery at. So if we wanted to do this in a hurry, we could set this to uh, large. But I'm a firm believer that if you're not in a rush, you're better off just to uh, let anything charge slowly over a period of time. It tends to be kind of easier on pretty much anything that you're doing. So now we see that this is the interesting part of this. When we first connected it up, I think it was at 50 some percent or whatever, you'll see this display start to slowly go up. And once it stabilizes, I've noticed with this unit, then that's the actual valid percentage charge on this battery. Now, this particular battery, I've had it uh, sitting outside in the vehicle that I've been kind of working on for a while. So it'll, the battery's been dying over time. It's, you know, Canada and it's November now. So, of course, in the cold, the battery dies quicker. So this is not bad. This battery's been outside for quite a length of time on a, ba on a vehicle that hasn't been running and charging it. So now we see that this is around 57% into 60 and it's leveling off. So uh, basically we just let this sit on here 
and it's going up okay this is actually fairly charged we'll just leave this on here and come back in like an hour or so and just check up okay so it's a couple hours later uh, you can see that the uh, indicator here is showing us it's 99 percent charged because as I said earlier we had selected the battery percentage up here on this button we change this we select that we want to see the voltage voltage comes up as 15.5 so obviously it's maxed up here now go back to the percentage 99 percent charged so we want to disconnect it so uh, safest way to do that kill the power to the unit first that's dead then just take our terminals off and uh, that's basically to have a charge a battery with one of these new style chargers.